What is going on guys? Today I'm going to be playing a fan game of Undertale called Undertale Aaron. Um, this time it's- and that's not like Game Grumps Aaron, that's just the name of this unicorn character. Um, this isn't actually on Game Jolt this time, this is an in-browser one on Itch.io, so I'll put a link to that in the description, as per the usual. Um, let's jump straight into it. It didn't have any sort of precursor screen other than like the heart flashing and the exclamation point. Um, so you're not missing anything, don't worry, it just drops you straight into the battle. Alright, let's, 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 let's take a crack at this. I just gotta, I gotta do a couple things. The microphone. Fuck it. That works. Alright. And, what's up? How my levels? How my levels at, boss? Okay, cool. Levels are fine. Alright, let's jump straight into and act. Uh. Hello? Okay, there we go. All good. Uh, what are we gonna do? Act. Check. Attack 5, defense 12. He smells fruity drinks and magic. Cheers, kid. Oh, hello. Okay. Uh, ooh. Dodged every- dodged every attack straight away. Nice. Good work. Uh. Search. You look around for something, you've managed to find a bottle of white rum. How's it going? Do I have to drink with this guy? Is he a social drinker? Is he one of those types? He smells of magic and- this is very well done. Um, you pour the white rum. What are you doing there, kid? I, I get the imagine this dude is very suave. Good art. Um, he doesn't seem to have many alternate sprites, but I think he's meant to just be like a... Uh, sort of, um... Not a one trick pony one. Uh, like a standard enemy, not a mini-boss or the like. Uh, let's search. Bottle of blue Kirikyu liqueur. Okay. I'm not sure if these drink names are references, or if they're actual brands, <laughs> or... I know white rum is probably a real drink, I'm ashamed to say, I don't know. That's looking rather interesting. Oh, it's the bubbles! That's cool. Okay, we've got the blue-orange mechanics going on. Oh shit, I moved. This goes for a while. Okay. How was I meant to be able to move into position? How's it going? Okay, so that's standard when there's no items in play. Ooh, nice. Oh, nice. It's still going. Why is it still going? Oh god, how long have I got? <laughs> oh, Jesus Christ, okay. I, I dodged them all, so that's that's good. Search. You look around for something, you manage to find a bottle of orange juice. Is he gonna get annoyed if I use that? Because it's not alcohol. This is very well done. Because this is the only fan game I have today, I'll also try out the genocide. I know a, people, a couple of people got annoyed that I didn't try the genocide of, um, <laughs> of Undertale Red, so I'll do that for this one. Orange juice. You pour the orange juice. You've made a Barbados sunrise. Ah, oh, I was making a cocktail out of... Uh. Oh shit, I walked straight into that. Oh, come on, how am I supposed to... Maybe... Yes, like that. Ah, no! Okay, cool. The unicorn is happy about his new drink. Spare. Well, that was good. See ya. You won! You earned 0 XP and 362 gold for that, jeez. Hold escape to restart. Yeah, this this is all of the standard encounter. Alright. You find an action martini. Let's, let's try and fight. I'm only level 1. Are you done? Attacks are no different yet. Oh. 21. Jeez, I'm not doing much, am I? Get out, child. <laughs> yeah, I was gonna say, if I, if I was just drinking, that would be underage drinking! But I never drank it. I just made the martini and gave it to him. Oh, wait. No. Why did those hurt me? You'll make me spill. Oh, okay. I can't hit the bubbles? Uh, spider donut. Which please makes Why would you even eat that? Oh, nice! They've got reactions to, um, items. Cool. Like, food items. Jaw, this is- this is a grind, isn't it? Oh god, now there's bubbles down the bottom. This is getting hard. Du, 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 du. Why is he so tough? Okay. 
30 damage. There we go. I gotta get it in the center center. That is rude, yeah. I wouldn't believe massacring people to be of the highest politeness, but you never know. Some people have different tastes. You make me spill. Nice. Nice. Still on 17. I'm doing well at this, though. Maybe his defense is gonna get lower as I go, kinda like Asgore's. I don't know. Oh, I just missed it. Well, I only lost one point of damage, though. One point of attack, though, so that's good. <laughs> Do, 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 do. I love this song so much. You gotta make sure your encounter music's good, because people are gonna always hear it a lot. I know it's the standard encounter, I'm not saying this is the fan game's specific encounter music. Pew! Straight in the middle. That's rude. Ah. Get fucked on, son. I've got to- I've got a little bone to pick with you, Unicornius. Why would you even drink that? Okay, sort of the same one as before, but at least it noticed I was drinking and not eating. Oh shit, 51. That's a lot more than it was. Specifically 20 points more. So yep, his defense is getting lower as we go. 53. So we're probably around 75% of the way if it's gonna exponentially grow. Ooh, that was total fluke. That's rude. Uh. I love the way the projectiles are just flying around after the after he's already finished the turn. People gotta learn to cull their projectiles, yo. Butts pie. Yeah, I I probably don't need to use anything yet. It'll make me spill. Yep, I'm alright. I got this. Ah, I just missed it by... Missed it by that much. Okay, his defense doesn't seem to be going down anymore. It's like a two-step. Look, don't touch. Behold my majesty. My unicorn body. Make me spill, you know. I, I wish there was a little more fight dialogue, because... Just because of how long this fight is actually taking. Oh, straight in the middle. Oh, get some. Oh, wait. I had an action, didn't I? Hester. You tried to touch his horn. He's mildly annoyed. Okay, that didn't change, like, his stats or anything. Just try to touch his horn when I'm trying to kill him. Oh, come on. Uh... Disgust. Tell Aaron all about the taste of spiders. Something I didn't want to know. Okay, no, his stats aren't lowered. I kind of forget that you could probably act. Yeah. Oh shit, okay, 88. I think that did actually impact it? I don't know, it didn't tell me it impacted his defense or whatever. 92, jeez. Alright. Uh, uh, I don't have enough health items to keep doing this. Nice cream. Yep, HP was maxed out. I'm gonna go a couple more rounds and I'll be alright. Ah! The irony of getting hurt, waiting for a round to finish where you healed something. I got this. Are you done? Okay, orange. Oh, come on. The bouncing, really? The bouncing? God, the bouncing. Smells of magic and regret. That's sad. 88. We're gonna hit 88, Marty. Listen to me, Marty. I'm the doc from Back to the Future, Marty. Uh, butterscotch pie. A pie made of butts. That is really disgusting. <laughs> oh, maybe I have to disgust him to get his defense down. But it doesn't, it doesn't tell you that that's the case if that's what's happening. Yeah, because I just did a shit ton more damage to him than I did before. Dun, 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 dun. 
right down the center. Oh, no death dialogue. It was a little bit underwhelming. But other than other than that, really well put together fan game. The character design was nice, didn't look out of place. Uh, nothing too jarring either, it was kind of just a simple answer. It would be there, you'd just run into him. He'd probably be in Grillby's or something, I don't know. But um, yeah, very well put together. I'll put a link in the description for you guys, and that was by Unicorn. Uh, uni with a Y instead of an I. So yeah, thanks for watching guys, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye.